180 days. That's the number of days since Hillary Clinton held her last press conference. She brags about all the interviews she's done this year, 300 of them, she claims. But 2016 is nearly halfway over. The primary season is drawing to a close. The conventions are coming up in a matter of weeks. And we've not seen a single press conference from Hillary this entire year. Why is that? She seems comfortable enough making fun of the way Donald Trump treats the press. When he calls certain biased reporters losers, she insinuates that he's not treating the media with respect. But Hillary, how is ignoring the press, foregoing a time-honored tradition in our nation of the people asking politicians questions so we can vet your character, your policies, your political integrity, how is that treating us with respect? It's a simple answer, it's not. Forgive my cynicism, Mrs. Clinton, but do you have something to conceal? Are you fearful that questions from the press would put you in a sticky situation? Perhaps leave you tongue-tied or force you to resort to lies to cover up your email scandal? Would allowing the arm of the people, the free press, a glimpse at the unscripted Hillary leave us horrified about your role in Benghazi or disgusted about the alleged charity fraud at the Clinton Foundation, aghast at how exactly you've secured such an astonishing majority of the superdelegates in the Democratic primary? Who knows? We the people certainly don't, because funnily enough, as a candidate who claims to be a champion for the people, Hillary, you won't even talk to the people. And that's my final point. Reach me on Twitter at Liz underscore Wheeler. And if you liked the show, please send me an email at oann.com slash contact. Be sure to catch Tipping Point again tomorrow at 10 p.m. Eastern, and have a good night.